Welcome back to Empire Total War. I ran out of time last night to show a video and I thought oh, I'll blow it, I'll I'll do it this morning, so um okay, or to upload a video it would have been. Anyway, um I've been looking around at things and I've decided that this guy has got to go. I've got problems. I showed you on the last video, didn't I? Uh, I'll say this guy, it's the Justice Minister. I've had a look around and I've decided to replace him with the jughead. <laughs> um if you look at that you can see the okay, I get minus happiness and ability, but I get um I get plus um I get pluses for the is that the right one there for the lower classes. So let's put him in there then. So okay, it gives me some advantages and some not, but I'm gonna go for the jughead for now and hope he picks up some positive traits along the way. I, I hope to get to show you in a minute how it improves things. You know, I just have to skip back to the last video to find out what the problems were originally. So okay, I've decided to um go for it. I've been thinking about this for some time and and now I've sort of been challenged to do it. I think it's BFAS or someone out there who said, why don't you do this? So I'm going to go for it because um, it, it, this is just going to go on forever. I think I'm going to be continually um, attacked by these flaming Indians and I'm just going to be repairing buildings, um, replenishing my troops and all sorts and it, it's just going to be a nightmare. So I'm sending some of my troops back to the main town, back to here. Um, and they're just going to defend the place. And I'm going to take... Hey? Oh, it's one of those weird things, isn't it? Yeah, okay. Um, and these over to here as well. So I've got a fairly mobile force here. They're not the slower infantry, or the slower anything. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Not a lot, I know, but it's going to have to do, I'm afraid. Um, can I replenish any of these? I can't, can I? They're their maximum numbers, aren't they? These are are, uh, are a big disappointment for me. Um, unfortunately, he's going to have, uh, I don't know, the equivalent of file arm citizen, but going to be massive units, probably with range all the way to back to Paris. <laughs> oh, moan, groan again. Um, right, okay, I'm going to put these on here. Now, I'm going to do this for this turn only. Um, if, um, if he doesn't come at me here, then what I'm going to have to do is um, maybe put these back into here. So at least I've got flexibility now. I can move them in one turn to where I need them to be, or I can get them back. So I, I think that's probably the way to do it. I don't want to take any more risks. Anyway, if you remember what Hanover was like when I showed at the end of the last video, uh, not Hanover, it's uh, Copenhagen actually, um, over here you could see we had problems. Well, now we have problems the other side. We now have problems with the nobility. They're angry. Um, I, I don't know if it tells me any more about their angriness when I leave over the top of it there, but anyway, so now it's the upper classes or the middle classes, whatever, that are angry. So I'm just going to put up with that. Poor middle classes. Never mind. They always get squeezed, don't they? So Right, okay, what well, what's that? I thought do you know, I thought there was somebody between my places then, but it isn't at all, is it? So um, Right, okay, people are on their way back. Uh, I don't think I need to do anything else. I think that's all I planned anyway, so let's give that a go and see what happens. Uh, I'm hoping it means that Copenhagen um, and Hanover will be settled. I know they've got problems with the nobility now, but I don't think they had problems with nobility last time. I think it was only their lower classes, which means they'll only be unsettled once, or for one turn, or whatever it is. Um, it's important to me that the lower classes don't riot, because they're likely to damage a cultural building which is giving lots of pluses. And I'd like, if I can, to get away with no rebellion. You know, with all these um, dragoons that I had for settling the whole of Britain and then move them into parts of Europe, I'm now hitting um, uh, Copenhagen with all of those. So I'm really hoping that that's going to be enough to, to keep them settled. I know it was said that I didn't have enough dragoons, and you're probably right, actually, whoever said that one. But I, d I didn't want to move forward, leaving Denmark in my flank there. And I know they've got Iceland. I know they'll still develop a big fleet, but... I still think it's better um, to move the border forward slowly um, it, instead of leaving gaps. See, ah, now they've gone for me, haven't they, the Pueblos? That's good news for me. That really is very good news for me. Um, I'm hoping now, this is just, I, I don't know, I'm just hoping that, that he's left. Um, enough space at the gap there for me to, uh, at the back there for me to be able to get through. Who's there? Somebody in France. Well, let's take him out of here and get him to do something fairly useful. This one here, and um, we'll get him to go, I don't know where, perhaps. I don't want him to interfere with this um, Hanover, um, Copenhagen thing that, thing that I've got going on, so can I get him through? I think he's going to interfere anyway, isn't he? I well, think he's going to get there this turn, though, is he? No, he isn't. Okay, well, let's get him going, say, through to here or something. Ah, that's good. 
So he goes that way around. That's better. Okay, good. Um, letters of demands. Right, okay, well, I can handle that. That's not a problem. Letters, no problem. I can light the fire with them. So, trait gained. Good listener. Ah, that sounds good. Oh, subterfuge. That's one of my spies. So, I'm just keeping my spies forward at the moment in a position where I can, um, well, obviously spy on other people. They're agents, aren't they? But I don't want them to assassinate. I don't want to do anything that's going to risk them being in the position they are where I can spy on various other people. So, right, okay, what are these? Yeah. They're infantry. They're already being replenished. So, I'll get those into there. I think I've got room for those in there. Have I? Uh, yes, I've got space. So, they can go straight in. Good. Now, the guns. I think these are the guns. Yeah, I'm not sure they can actually reach. So, I'm not going to risk that. What I'm going to do is get some dragoons out of here. Um, five, hopefully. One, two, three, four, five. Not too bothered about which ones now. We seem to have held the place, so I'm pleased about that. So, into there. And into there. Into there. Select the five, not the artillery. Into there. And then into there. Please say they can get in. They can't get in. It's this daft thing again, isn't it? Select one. That'll get them in. Yep, good. Right, and take five out. So I'll swap these here for these here. Just pretty arbitrary, really, of course. I just want the infantry out, so... I don't want them all out. I want a, a decent defence force in there. Oh, by the way, I've read on the forum a way to get rid of the no forts option. Which means I can have forts if I want. So, I might decide to do that at some point in the game, because it has been a bit of a problem for me, not having forts. Oh no, what happened then? You were supposed to go into there. What happened? You couldn't reach, could you, because of the artillery? Dear me. Right, okay, you can though. You can get into here. Do you know, I bet you I've got room for them now, have I? Oh yeah, I have, because I gave up... It's, all, it's the same five, they went all the way, didn't they? So I have got room, of course I have. Right. Why can't we get into there? I don't understand why some of them can get in and some of them can't. Maybe they're just better infantry. Oh well, never mind. You can go in. And you two? Wh which ones of you can and can't? None of you. That's really strange, isn't it? Did I miss something out? Is it because I picked up the artillery? I think maybe the artillery slowed them down, you know. <laughs> right, okay. Can the guns go further? No, they can't. Right, okay, well, I'll, I'll move them on their way anyway, so... Hey? What? <laughs> the guns seem to be able to move further now. I wonder if I can inch them all one at a time. That would be really weird, wouldn't it? I don't understand it. Maybe one of the guns is lighter than the others, but... Main thing is, all of these, next turn, are going into there. Right? Okay. In fact, what I'll do is I'll move those into there, and move him into there. He's going to join them. So he'll join them, they'll move to there. Alright, good. Okay, Oof, what a mess. Right, um, what else did I want to do? Ah, yes, I'm going to replenish those troops as well. Uh, all of them that are in here. I don't think they need it. Yeah, they do. They're already getting it anyway. So these here, come on. You guys. We'll sort you out. And also, well, I want everybody in here replenished, really. So those two that are already being so, like that one that one I can ignore and let's get these yeah not many it's only those new ones I've brought in so we'll soon have a full army and then I'll be able to filter some down to here as well or maybe even recruit some oh crikey do you know I thought I saw some enemy incursions then but nope there aren't any so that's excellent recruitment report <coughs> agent recruited good now let's see what we can do with these engines these pain in the bum engines have I actually got them on this ship I'm not sure uh I think I... they look like they're on, don't they? Actually, if I look at the Navy, that will give me a chance to see them, won't it? Other than that, they're not there, are they? They're not there in the port. Which means they're not there. Right, OK. Which means they're on the ships, I hope. Um, I just don't remember putting them on the ships. OK, those out of the way. Now, this guy here... Let me just check that they are actually on. Yeah, good. Right, OK, now he brought them forward, didn't he? This looks like a big army, two big armies. We'd have struggled to fight him off, then it would have cost us a fortune to repair our troops afterwards, replenish, repair any damaged buildings, defending two points as well, raising a massive army in New Orleans. It would have been just a nonsense, so I'm not going to do it. So, 
Let's hope whatever is in here, we can fight it before these get back. That's going to be <sighs> the big wish, isn't it? Oh no, we can't get there. Oh no, why can't I get there? Why can't... Who can't get there? Oh, what a pain. Oh dear, I think we're in trouble. I think we're in big trouble. Well, at least he can get there and hold the place. But I think they can get back. I think they can. Blast. He might even have somewhere elsewhere. What can we do? It's not looking good. I didn't even want to fight this one. Um, oh, look, they're all going to come on one at a time as well. These seem able to move further than the gen... No, the general can get further. Right, let's see if I can get these all close enough to do something useful. He's the one that can't move, isn't he? Yeah. I could have might as well have just left him behind. Um. Okay, they can't reach either. Oh dear. Right, okay, let's go in. It's well in our favour. Have I got have I got everybody in? Oh no, that's <laughs> it's a Spanish gun, isn't it? Um one, two, three, four, five, six, seven to fight one to well it must be seven because it's full. Two, four, six, seven, yes it is. But they've got 150 in each of their units. Oh no, no, no. I think I'm going in there with about 310 against um what looks to be I should be able to read it up at the top. Three, six, nine, well, I I don't know, about a thousand, is it? Well, it's 700 for a start, so it's um, 1,050, isn't it? It has to be. Yeah, so, ah, oh dear. But it does show in my favour. I don't know why. Five, ten, five, six, five is our fighting ability. Five, four, six. So we are better... No, they're, they're melee nine. Right, so we're only melee seven. Yeah, they've got better melee attack than every one of my units. What's their morale like? Morale... Eight! They've got really good morale. Better than ours. Oh dear. I think we're in trouble. Uh, what do I do? Fight them? Well, I'm going to shoot at them, of course, as they come in. That might help. It's not going to wipe out a complete 150, is it? Um, and I've got... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven against seven. Unit to unit. We're going to have to attack them in the flank, aren't we? I don't even know what them... See, look, the melee attack of those is five. They're not good enough, are they? And yet, that shows in my favour. What do I do here? I didn't want another Indian battle. I seem to have had loads of them recently with all these incursions that they've been doing. I'm going to see if an auto-resolve is kinder to me. Let's do a demand surrender. Refused. Auto-resolve. Victory. With only 71 losses. Oh, I'm going to take that. I'm happy with that. Yep. That's it. Um, I'll tell you what, I think that is a better result than I could have got myself. So I'm going to I'm going to have to settle for that one, aren't I? There's no doubt about it. Trouble is now with these buildings is they're no good to me. I need to get rid of them all. It's one of the reasons why I didn't even want this territory, really. I'd have had peace with them. I'd have done anything, really, to improve things. But now that isn't so bad. I might even upgrade that, actually. I wonder if I can afford to upgrade that now. I might be able to. Now this, I don't think it, you know, it can't. It can't develop anymore. So, right, okay. I wonder if I should um, actually develop that now. Um, think, 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 think. Um, oh, I don't know. Um, I think not, actually, this turn. I think maybe I'll get them next time. But I will replenish the troops. Okay. Uh, right. What if I could have won that battle as successfully as that? I don't think I could, you know, really, to be honest, because their melee ability is really, really good. In fact, the home defence type units are extremely good in this game. You know, they really are. Maybe I should have raised another unit as well before I did that attack, but hey, I've got away with it anyway. That's the main thing. So, uh, this one doesn't need replenishing because he didn't get near enough to the action. He can't get back anywhere, so uh, do I put him back on there? 
ready to go back? I don't think so, actually. I think what I'll do is I'll leave these now to defend this place. Um, because, you know, just in case the Cherokees start to get a bit silly. Let's put him back. Okay, good. Now, all those Indians are gone. Excellent news. Look on here. Region captured Texas. Excellent. And nation destroyed Pueblos. So, that's good, isn't it? Look at this. Looks like they've had a whole city wrecked, a whole civilization. I don't think it would have looked like that, to be quite honest. I think it would have been two, a few tattered tents and huts and such like. I don't know. Anyway, um, what else did I need to do? Um, ah, I know. I know what I've forgotten. I think now Copenhagen can be taxed. Oh, it doesn't look good, actually. Minus one. Ah. Hmm. I wonder if I can afford another dragoon from here or something. Oh, I thought I could. No, maybe I just can't afford it. I can't do it yet. Money they were settled last turn. Went no, no, because the nobility will be. Oh, that'll be minus two, won't they? No, I th I'm going to have to leave them untaxed for now. Oh, that's a nuisance, isn't it? Oh, I see. It's probably because these buildings aren't complete yet, are they? No, that's it. I just need those to be completed, and then all will be well, I'm pretty sure. Could I have left another unit in there or something? No, no more spaces. I wonder, can I sneak one more Dragoon unit into there? If I could, I could then tax it. I'll try. I'm not even sure he's going to be able to reach. I can, you know. Will he make the difference, though? So I'll still have to take a unit out, won't I? Depends which unit I remove, doesn't it? Let's try that. I didn't think I, I was going to be able to get more than five Dragoons out, but I do seem to have managed to get one more, so... Let's try. He can't get in anyway. Damn, that was a waste, wasn't it? Autre chose? Oui, Miller. Damn, it's because I had that infantry in the way, wasn't it? That those others in the way. Okay. Um, no, blast! If I'd have only put one more dragoon in, then we'd have been fine. That's a real nuisance, isn't it? These are okay, though. Well, I've now ended up bringing one more out than I really expected and hoped for, so... Oh, well. Never mind. Um, I thought I might as well bring that Dragoon back next turn, because he's totally hopeless up there, isn't he? Um, okay, uh, we do these silly things, don't we? Now, okay, I need to go back to the Americans and sort these out, because um, my Niagara troops, the ones that are up here, need... In fact, let's just check these as well. Just to make sure these are full. I think these are, because they've only recently been recruited. Yeah, they're okay. So, over in Niagara... Did move those ships back in? Did no, yes. Niagara troops over here. I want to make sure they're fully replenished, just in case anybody decides that they fancy having a go at them. Good. And then... Um, I think I might recruit over here in Quebec. I know I'm already doing so, but I can get another one. Yep. Yeah. And... I don't think these need to be replenished anyway, actually. Yeah, they're all okay, aren't they? Right, good. <coughs> uh, I think that's it, for now. Oh, we're paying about that tax. If I'd have only... Oh, never mind. If, but some maybes. Um, loads and loads of money to spend. 2,907. Why is that? Why haven't I spent that money on something useful? Um... I wonder if there's something else. Uh, I could recruit Dragoons in Copenhagen now, I suppose. I wonder if I've repaired that place. Let's just have a quick check of that. Oh, blimey, what am I doing in India? Oh, by the way, that's that place they were talking about, which was Dutch. It's now um, gone over to the um, Mughals or whatever, I think. Um, uh, I think maybe this place has not yet been... It hasn't, you know. I wonder. It might just be worth repairing that. 1,800 and something. 
uh, do I do that? Um, I think, I think not. I think I'm going to hang on to the money. No, nope, I'm going to hang on to the money. Yes, I don't think I need those quite yet in there. So, okay, let's go for it then. See what happens. Oh, I've got ten minutes of video time left. No battle. Uh, that turned out easy for me, didn't it, with the Pueblos? But that was really touch and go, especially when I couldn't get the troops in that I needed, and him having so many, and so good as well. Just imagine, I mean, some of my units are like 60 men, 45 or 60 men with poorer uh, melee attack than his, and his morale was incredible as well, so oh, we'd have, I think we'd have been beaten. Military alliance, uh, yeah, I'll go for that, why not? Uh, sounds good to me. Um, they'll give me access, they'll give me all kinds of things. Um, they're giving me trade, I think, as well, weren't they? But the main thing is that that, um, that they're giving me money. <laughs> they offered me some money. I could have probably bargained it up a little bit, but then I might have risked losing the whole deal because, you know, often when it's on a turn end like that, they just retract their offer, don't they? So, hmm. Right. And the other thing I haven't looked into, you know, is whether Texas will be settled with seven units. I think I took seven over, didn't I? Will that be enough to settle the population? Hmm. Right. England. Uh, right, okay. Well, let's have you doing something useful in England, then. Because you're not really needed elsewhere. What's that now? This should be 100% now, this I would have thought. 76% and this one only 50% so uh, let's get him up here then we well, he can do a bit before he gets there can't he so it looks to me as though um, the English ones have died or I've moved them all out I'm not too sure now that's only 70% as well but I anyway, know I'm quite happy about that place right workers on strike in Texas can I settle this place with seven units total including all the damage they suffered Two, four, oh, that's seven there. Two, three, six, seven. I thought I had another, I've got another one there, haven't I? I wonder if I take him back. That might be an idea. Right, okay, let's get a town hall in here for a start. That's to make the place happier. That's not bad, actually, settling it with only seven. I wonder why there's so little resistance to foreign occupation. It's twelve, actually, so... I don't know, maybe my troops count... A lot more in here. I'm not too sure, but okay. Um, I'm going to build. I'm going to build this plantation now because I've got the money. I can afford it. I'm rich, and this one here. Let's get a farm in there. The only problem that I've got is that there isn't a trading area in here yet. A trading port. Um, yeah, you see, we can't. Oh, we haven't got a farm. That's predicted, isn't it? Um, oh gosh, what a terribly low income. It's rubbish, isn't it? Uh, what I need really is this. Look at that, 19 to. Be interesting to see how that improves when I get um, when I get the town hall um, and I start to get some money in as well. Recruitment costs, bloody blah, blah, repression in the region. I don't know, it's, but I could really do with that port there. Um, okay, let's get these back into here then, since we don't need them in there. No, I haven't done a military crackdown. Nothing needs to be replenished or anything, so we'll get those back to there. I didn't need to take him over there in the first place, did I, really? Nope. Okay, uh, over to here for now, because I think my ship's recruited now, is it? Yes, it is. Right, well, let's get my rather wonderful navy out. Ah, oh, no, let's put him in there first. Why not? And then he can come out into here. Okay, I'm going to leave my... Um, sloop in there to protect that. I don't quite know why. I just think that something needs to... Let's just see where the enemy are as well, by the way. You know, the pirates. They're here, aren't they? So, where can they reach to? They can get to... There. Along there. Where can I get to? Can I lift it any further? I can't, can I? Um, okay. I'll take the brig, but I'll leave the sloop behind. I can get to... I think, if I go to here, I'm out of their way. Uh, D 
do I get away with it if I go to there? I think I'm going to have to click on there again, aren't I? So let's just see if they can reach that point there. They can't, can they? In fact, they can't even reach here where I can go to. Let's try that again. Right, OK. <sighs> right, OK. It's important, as you know. <laughs> I don't want a massive navy coming for me. If I can help it. Yeah, you see, they can't get any further than there, can they? So if I go, say, to here, I think I'm safe, you know. I think that's safe. Maybe I should have inched them into there. But I haven't done, so... I think we're safe. Look at that. We're safe. I just have to hope there's nothing in here, and if there is, it's just one or two ships. But... I can't know anything else about that, can I? Uh, what was that? Workers on strike in Texas. Yeah, we know about that and we've settled the place, so that's not a problem. Netherlands as well. Ah, well, I'll tell you what, this place... Um, where are we? There. This place, I would think, should be Roman Catholic by now. 78%. Ah, oh, that's not bad, is it? What about this place now? 47%. And um, this place up here... None, at the moment. <laughs> OK, I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to bring... Um, him over to here to help settle that place and then I'm going to take a couple of these over to here to settle this place. Okay. Because this place here should now be on the up, shouldn't it? It should be improving. Yeah, it is. Anyway, it's simply because it's got a church in there. So that's going to go in its favour. It's gradually going to be Catholicised, isn't it? Right, let's demand Texas. Yeah, OK, we know all about Texas. Military technology cavalry drill. Next is platoon firing. Yeah, but doesn't make any difference to me because I still can't get what I want, which is the steel ramrod, which means I can't move into the later period, which is where the socket bayonets appear. Not unless there's something clever in this game that takes me to 1750 and then suddenly at 1750, whoopee doopy, they become available. I just don't know. I really don't know. Maybe the drill book's the same, maybe they don't kick in. But from what I've read on the forum, it seems to me that they simply haven't done it yet. They haven't, um, I don't know, they haven't done the skins for the socket bayonets or whatever or something like that. Or if they have, they haven't integrated it into the game yet. So, Right, OK. Um, what's that? Oh, that's that. Um, yeah, OK. Right, I can ignore those. That's that uh, six or eight that I've just moved out with all the other ships, isn't it? Right, now, Denmark, do I upgrade these? I wonder. I think I might just... Uh, I'll take a rain check on those, as they say. Natural causes. Somebody's died. Ah, that'll be my priest, or whatever it was I had in there. I did have a priest in there. OK, well, let's bring the agent out to a more prominent position. Um, we're sort of trusting the Spanish, aren't we, and the Americans. I don't know whether else he can go to sort of... Well, one of these places. These are... Uh, Cree. Let's go and have a look at what the Cree might be up to. Because I have a feeling we're going to be able to see what's going on here anyway. So let's keep a watch over the Cree, just to see if they get unsettled or not. Right, OK, that's construction report. Yeah, OK, I said I'd come back to that, didn't I? Natural causes. Yeah, we know about that one. This one, natural causes. Who's this one, then? That's... Hey? Somebody from here is dying of natural causes. Why didn't I have anybody in there, did I? Um. I don't quite understand that, actually. My general's still alive over here, so... Who's died of natural causes? I didn't have any agents or anything over here, did I? Well, I don't remember having one anyway, so... Maybe they created an admiral for him after that battle, and now he's died. Oh, I, d I don't quite understand that, but OK. Um, what shall I do? I'm going to recruit in here, actually. I'm going to recruit in New Orleans... Um, because I can't get a horse, not not decent horse anyway, I'm going to get a CO in here. Good. Um, and oh, what else do I do? Um, let's sort out Hanover again, I think. OK, let's go and have a look at Hanover. Uh, I think I just made those dragoons back. Because I've done a silly thing there, haven't I? So let's get those back in here. Him, and then him. Him, and then him. All of them. Ah, now I have too many. Ah, so I'll swap all of those then, with one lot of dragoons. Why not? Okay, good. Now, uh, 
So, he can actually get back inside, can't he? I think he is going to have to go somewhere else, I don't know. Let's actually, I know what to do. But they are settled, aren't they? Yeah, they're all right. They could be slightly better, but no, I think that's that'll do. Let's give them uh, another load of Dragoons to join them. Yeah. Okay, and we'll send these two Dragoons over to here, just to bolster this place a little. Anywhere we go through, I think there is, isn't there? I think we go through here first. Yep. We might even go through that one. Let's go and have a look. Mm, tend to bypass it, but I don't know if it makes it any quicker to add that corner on, actually. Oh, it does, actually. That's an improvement. That's a big improvement. What about through to here? Yeah, I think that's about right, isn't it, then? I don't think they're connected by road. They're not. Right, yeah, made it a bit quicker. Anyway, for certain they're going to get there now, aren't they? That's the main thing. Right, now, uh, that means that Dragoon can come back, doesn't it? Uh, I think it's probably best to bring the Dragoon back now, because I've got a lot, enough Dragoons in here. And I do need a decent force of infantry in there, just in case the Swedes start to get um, daft ideas. So, um, infantry to there, to there, to there, and then to there. I often wonder about the wisdom of going into that one instead of straight to the place. Oh, what is going on? Oh, right, okay. Um, can you help him in? He's in. Right, okay. Hmm. Yeah, funny how that happens, isn't it, eh? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> okay, that's the nearest I get to a Cockney accent. Uh, natural causes. Right, okay. I think we looked at... We did, we looked at those. Right, okay. This one, astronomical aberration. Right, well, f do you know, I think we've settled all the places now, over in there. Um, I've got a pretty decent amount of money there to spend. 32,000... Sorry, 3,217, which is pretty good. Um, Navy's on its way. I think that's probably about... Ah, I know. Can I tax it? Oh, do you know, I should have checked it when I had the, um, uh, the Dragoons there. Oh, they're going to go minus one. Damn it, why didn't I put those... Dragoons in! How stupid can I get about these things? I think I might risk that, you know, because last turn their nobility was okay, wasn't it? Or was it? I'm really not too sure. Um, last time I untaxed it, and I had, yeah, I had the Dragoons unhappy, didn't I? I think I have to untax it. You know, I don't think I've got a choice. Oh, what a pain. I could have had another Dragoon. I'm going to have to put another Dragoon in, aren't I, to settle it. Can I get him all the way there this time, though, or is something stupid going to happen? Mind you, last time there was some infantry in the way, wasn't there? So, I think I'll do that. Let's get a Dragoon up there and swap things round again. So if I said, I often wonder about going into there first. I'm going to do it. Okay, into there, there, and... There, because it's a lot of money to lose, you see. Uh, into there, and then into there. Good. Right, come on. You can get into there. Don't be silly. I know you can get into there. Okay, let's take somebody out. <coughs> Excuse me. Him, for instance. Right, now, Dragoons, you've got to go in there. Oh, thank goodness for that. Right, okay, are you happy enough now? Oh, no! Oh, I can't believe this! Right, untax them then. Oh, dear, dear, dear me. Um. Right, okay, done it now, so that's it. To there, to there. Right, replenish him. Anything else needs replenishing in here? Maybe I should do those. There are some already being done. They all look pretty good, actually. I think they're all okay then, you know. Even the Dragoons are okay in there. What about over here? Um, yeah, let's do these minus the Dragoons. Um, nobody else is there. Nope. How much is that? 3,006? What? What on earth is costing all that money? It's these Karazias and everything, isn't it? Ah, oh, no. I think I'm going to have to do it, you know. Wow! 
I can't even afford to do them all. That was horrendous. That was absolutely horrendous. I had no idea it was going to cost me all that. <sighs> right, OK. I'm not sure that jug head was a good idea, actually. He doesn't seem to have... Oh, anyway, it's done now, so what can I do? Um, maybe, maybe I should put him back now to something else so I can tax it. Do you know what I mean? Change the jug head for somebody... There might be even somebody better. What have we got here now? Right, happiness and ability. Minus one, minus... Well, let's judge it on what we've got in there in the mo at the moment. Right, what does he give? He gives plus one management to the lower classes, right? And he gives minus one to the nobility. So we get a plus two for the lower classes and minus one for the upper. Plus two, minus one. Right, okay, what will these give me? Um, uh, right, okay. Um, he doesn't give me the plus two for the lower classes that I need. Who will give me plus two for the lower classes that I need? Um, crikey, he's got loads. He's a patron, though, of the Navy. Uh, I don't think there's anybody that's going to give me plus two for the lower classes. Um, uh, oops, him. No. There isn't anybody good enough. No one will give me plus two for the lower classes. What does he give? He gives... Um, he gives plus one for the nobility. No. Um, oh, he gives a plus one. No. Damn. There's nobody, you know. Uh, I just unrest. Right, minus one happiness. I can't do it, can I? There is nobody better than him for now. The best we can hope for is a jughead. Yep, that's what democracy is all about, folks. Not even a democracy, actually. We're still a monarchy. But anyway, the point is, we can't get anybody better than that. Anyway, 37 and a half minutes. I'm well over time, so I'm going to have to call it a day at that one. Thanks for watching, folks. I hope to get this one up. Mm, I don't know, sometimes in the middle of the night, actually. It's Thursday today, so um, instead of waiting until tomorrow morning, I might get it up a little bit quicker. OK, thanks again, folks.